Dr. Anthony Fauci says the U.S. is carefully, mo carefully monitoring whether all Americans will need another COVID-19 booster. ABC 10 News anchor Derek Stahl is going in depth to explain why the U.S. isn't racing towards a fourth dose like some countries. Right now, health officials say Americans who are moderately or severely immunocompromised, like cancer patients, should get the equivalent of a second booster, a fourth dose for people who got mRNA, or a third dose for those who got J&J. &J. But other countries have gone further. Israel has been giving fourth doses to adults 60 and up, plus anyone at high risk of exposure at work. Chile, Denmark and South Korea are also offering fourth doses to certain populations. The question people ask is, will I, I being everyone, need now a fourth booster shot? This week, Dr. Anthony Fauci said the general public still does not need a fourth dose, at least not yet. The potential future requirement for an additional boost or a fourth shot for mRNA or a third shot for J&J &J is being very carefully monitored in real time. He pointed to a new study from the CDC on boosters during the Omicron wave. It found protection from hospitalization dropped from 91% in the first two months after the booster to 78% after four months. But that study has a catch. The CDC didn't break down the data by age or by risk factors. So that 78% protection could actually be much higher in healthy people, says UC San Francisco's Dr. George Rutherford. It's waning a little bit for sure. But the question is, can you do anything about it, right? Is that what a fourth shot does? Does it actually reverse that trend and boost you way back up? He says the debate is whether we need a fourth dose of the existing vaccine recipe or if we should wait for a vaccine tailored to a new variant. In Israel, people 60 and older who got a fourth dose of Pfizer's vaccine four months after their third shot saw about four times as much protection from severe illness. But there's very little data on how much another booster might help younger people. What I don't want to do is chase this. What I want to do is see definitive studies that say, yes, this confers a, a definitive, uh, definite benefit that lasts this long. In the U.S., all adults became eligible for boosters three months ago on November 19th. With Omicron infections steadily dropping, University of Washington's Dr. Ali Mokdad says most Americans are well protected for now. But yes, it's possible before summer was waning immunity and if Omicron is still spreading, we may, some of us may need to go and get a fourth dose. Some of us. Dr. Fauci has said that if the U.S. expands recommendations for a fourth shot, it could be targeted based on age or underlying conditions to those who need it most. Derek Stahl, ABC 10 News. Now, the head of vaccine research at the FDA said they'll continue to watch hospitalization data to see if protection from one booster drops farther. He said if another dose is needed, the best time might be this fall, so it could be timed to flu vaccines.